So you want to create a SaaS product and all you need is the right idea. In my previous videos, I shared many strategies to generate and validate profitable software ideas. But today I'm taking it a step further. I'm going to reveal three specific SaaS ideas that you can take and turn into a profitable business within just a few weeks. The thing is that I've been helping my client acquire a SaaS company and over the last three months we reviewed hundreds of tech startups. And what I discovered during this process really shocked me. We spoke with founders who launched software with minimal investment and within just a few months without any major marketing efforts they were hitting $30,000 in month recurring revenue. And now they have multiple offers to buy their companies for one, two or even three million dollars up to 8x multiplier. So in this video I will share the top three micro SaaS ideas you can launch with AI and no code tools in just a few short weeks. These ideas are small, smart and really easy to sell. The last idea is my favorite and if you launch an MVP of it I will be your first customer. So stick around till the end, grab your coffee and let's dive in. SaaS idea number one. This software completely surprised me with how easy it is to build and sell. It's simply a plugin that integrates Monday.com with QuickBooks API. We spoke to a few founders of similar integration tools and their stories were shockingly consistent. They built an MVP in just one to two months, then they spent almost nothing on marketing and finally they reached $30,000 in monthly recurring revenue just within a few months after a launch. All thanks to organic traffic from Monday.com Marketplace. Today, some of these products are being sold for one, two or even three million dollars. And the best part, you can build the app using no-code platforms like Bubble.io and use Zapier to handle all behind-the-scenes integrations between QuickBooks and Monday.com APIs. As for marketing, these founders made all possible mistakes and put in almost no effort. Yet, they still reached six-figure revenue. The Monday.com marketplace did most of the heavy lifting for them. Now, you might be wondering, Vitaly, if there is already a top competitor, how would I stand out? Here's the answer for you. First of all, the niche still is underserved, I think, and there's a ton of room for improvement. These founders spend only a few hours a month on client support and a minimal time on technical maintenance. Second, most of them take a universal approach to their marketing, focusing on solving integration for any type of company just using Monday and QuickBooks. But if I were to launch this, I would go for a more targeted approach. I would start by marketing a tailored solution specifically for, let's say, construction companies at first with landing pages and campaigns designed just for them. Then I would do the same for lawyers, for example, then for solar agencies, marketing agencies, e-commerce businesses maybe, and so on and on. Because this approach keeps lead costs as low as possible and helps attract users from competitors by offering them more relevant and more customized solution. Even though in reality, the functionality stays the same, all right? And as a bonus, this is super scalable SaaS idea. Once you master integration between Monday and QuickBooks, you can easily expand to other task management systems like Basecamp, Jira or Asana, as well as to other accounting platforms like FreshBooks or Xero. This way, you are not locked into any single platform, keeping your SaaS flexible and future-proof. SaaS idea number two. The next idea might seem boring, but I guarantee it's a hidden gem. Imagine a simple plugin for Shopify that helps store owners bundle their products. One example we talked to is Bundle Kit. With just a few thousand users, this app is pulling in six-figure revenue, all while the founders put minimal effort into marketing and sales. Who is doing the heavy lifting here? That's right, the Shopify marketplace. You could build the user interface for this app on a no-code platform in as little as two weeks something like Bubble.io. For the backend, you will just need a few days of help from a developer to ensure it's compatible as a Shopify add-on, so it can be easily installed by users from the Shopify marketplace. Other than that, this is something you could totally handle yourself even if you never written a single line of code. Once you make it work on Shopify, you are not limited to just that platform. You can expand the same concept to other marketplaces like Amazon, Etsy, and many, many more, creating plugins and add-ons with similar functionality tailored to those platforms. And this approach 
opens up a whole new world of revenue, leveraging built-in traffic from major marketplaces without requiring a massive marketing budget from you. Now, you subscribe to my channel to get a chance to win a free SaaS idea brainstorming session with me, and I'm moving on to the next software idea. SaaS idea number three. This idea is hands down my favorite. And if you build it, I will be your first customer. A couple of years ago, before I felt ready for YouTube videos, I committed to a 365 live stream challenge, going live every day for just one to three minutes to talk about something. It was tough, so I found Alip Jerk's 365 live stream planning system and I purchased it. With that system, I didn't have to stress over what to say each day. I just needed to personalize that topic with my specific message. Fast forward to today, now I have a full-time content manager, video editor, and agency helping with strategy and video production. But back then, if someone had offered me a basic SaaS that could pull my business data, understand my audience, and generate a full year's worth of daily content ideas, I would have gladly paid $100 per month or even more. The best part, you don't even need coding skills or developers to build this app. A no-code platform like Bubble.io can handle the interface for you. And you can also integrate it with AI chatbots like ChatGPT or Google Gemini for content generation. The core feature would be a calendar that suggests daily or weekly posts based on the user's business and audience details. It's pretty straightforward concept, but few good options exist in this space. If you create an MVP, I'm here to support you, provide advice, and even bring in your first users. I would be building this myself if I was not already deep into my third software product for our agency clients. If you are looking for even more ideas, check out my other video where I shared three AI SaaS concepts a few months back. And as I promised, I have a bonus for you. Just comment the word idea below and I will send you a link to 500 profitable SaaS ideas. Pretty sure that will give you all the possible inspiration you need. Now I'm on a mission to hit 10,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel by the end of this year. And I will be super thrilled if you could help me get there. Please subscribe to my account by clicking the button below. I would be over the moon. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and share it with your friends who might find it helpful. I'm already working on my next video with even more startup ideas. So stay tuned and see you there.